A new charter school is not letting distance learning stop them from supporting their students' emotional well being. Thank you for joining us at 6 30. I'm Brian Loftus. I'm Kirsten Joyce. As Kate Houston reports, the first digital assembly at Explore Academy focused around community. You've heard the saying, it takes a village to raise a child. Well, it takes a community to educate one. Cassandra Bowaka is a teacher at the newly opened Explore Academy. The charter school is going to great lengths to ensure their students are not only succeeding academically, but emotionally. Part of student choice, because it is for students, the school is for students, is to make sure that you know, their mind is taken care of. This survey titled Social Emotional Check-In is sent out to students, parents, and staff every two weeks. It asks questions surrounding how students are handling the workload, if they feel connected to the school, and if there are concerns about how a student is feeling. I like it because it's like we, they keep in touch with us. They keep in contact. Nancy Rosales is a member of the Explore Academy PTO. Her son is currently in eighth grade. For this school to um, make it a huge impression and a positive out of all this, it's, it's, it makes, uh, you know, not only a parent's life, but the child's life easier. Today, her son and dozens of other students took part in the school's first digital assembly. They were able to talk about their virtual clubs, plan out a school-wide movie night, and highlight some students who have gone above and beyond for their classmates. Rosales tells me while distance learning can be a challenge, kids will come out stronger from it. It's definitely a learning experience for, uh, for today's children. And if they can get through this, uh, they can get through anything. Kate Houston, 8 News Now. Kate, thanks. Explore Academy plans to continue sending out surveys even when back in the classroom. The school has more than 150 students from 6th and 9th grade. They plan to expand and are continuing enrollment.